वन ऑफ द योगा टीचर्स शी पुट अप ए मैसेज इन अर ग्रुप एंड होप यू हैड रिलैक्सिंग टू वीक्स ब्रेक फ्रॉम योगा एंड यू आर वेलकम टू द योगा क्लास एंड इट इज इट शुड बी अदर वे yoga relaxes not away from yoga it is relaxing it is the other way when we are not doing anything we will slip down to our base camp we slip down to our base camp uh, in uh, yoga yoga it is all about how to elevate your base camp Uh, in uh, 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 yoga yoga is uh, talking about uh, the physical level mental level and spiritual level physical extremities now we are feeling cold or uh, hot it is in a physical level hot and cold try to endure try to endure the physical discomfort in the uh, cold is there hot is there not keep on complaining like in the office also they say if so small change in the weather terrible weather it is terrible my mind has become terrible not the weather try to endure the challenges physical level it's a hot and cold and uh, sukha dukha in the happiness or uh, sorrow it is in the mental level mental level good times are there bad times are there not to get upset that is again a yoga and spiritual level in the higher level people may be praising you or criticizing you not to uh, go into uh, argument with them and uh, uh, make friendship only with people who are always praising or start arguing with people who are criticizing stay centered that is called as yoga in bhagavad gita it talks about sukha dukhe same kritva labha labho jaya jayo tada yoga ya yujyasva naivam papa avapsyasi is bhagavad gita shri krishna says that coming to the center is important that is yoga physical discomfort endure mental uh, extremities endure spiritual extremities endure and having come to the center whatever actions you do you won't incur any bad repercussion of that one it won't the uh, outcome of your actions won't bog you any bog you down any more with that pretext we want to elevate our base camp we want to go to the extreme possibilities a group of us are going to himalayas himalayas next month next month uh, 18 of us um, are coming from here few from india are joining we are going to himalayas himalayas uh, um, the, it is a, uh, uh, why i am uh, taking our students i want to take the students to discover the higher possibilities in life here we are getting two square meal we are in a ac car ac house everything cozy life is not that one try to go beyond your comfort zone that is one of the reasons behind we are going to the himalayas and um, uh, we are uh, going to uh, 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 our start a uh, trip starts from dehradun dehradun for example it is our base camp starting point dehradun is 430 meters above the sea level 430 meters sea level and himalayas unlike alps in europe in alps the mountain ranges slowly ascend trekkers in the himalayan uh, alps region they trek about 1000 feet a day settle down get acclimatized before proceeding further whereas himalayan mountain ranges unlike alps there is a steep mount 
they ascend quickly am in uh, dehradun 430 meters that evening i can reach badrinath badrinath is about 3300 meters kedarnath is 3800 meters above the sea level the ascent is too quick ascent is too quick it is said every 1000 meters of ascent oxygen content in the air reduces by 10% for example um, the whatever is the oxygen content in dehradun my base camp comfort zone in badrinath it is uh, 35% less than the uh, base camp in uh, kedarnath it is about 40% less than the base camp so you should know how to utilize how to breathe the that when i have everything in abundance becoming generous it is not something great when i have resources are short then still remaining calm be comfortable it is something extraordinary in the um, the base camp talking about our base camp our base camp in dehradun i said 430 meters for example people are going to uh, uh, everest uh, uh, climbing mountaineering their first base camp is at 5500 meters their first base camp is 5500 meters they the mountaineers they settle down for in the base camp for many days before they go to the higher uh, camps there are higher four camps are there the starting point is 5500 meters in uh, they say in uh, medical science also people get altitude sickness about 2500 meters once the oxygen content in the air reduces below 25% people start feeling um, altitude sickness altitude sickness sickness includes um, nausea hallucination constipation vomiting sensation headache uh, uh, indigestion and uh, 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 it's uh, uh, the giddiness limbs uh, may uh, not uh, working properly these are the symptoms people observe above 2500 meters when we are going going up we have to know we know resources are less when we are climbing up also we should not be in a too hurry to climb too hurry to climb slow and steady wins the race that is the saying it applies to going up also when you are trekking you slow not you are not in a hurry to rush through because oxygen content is reducing slow at a steady pace slow and rest if required you have to rest some uh, mountaineers what they do when they are climbing if they feel very not good they want to lie down along the way lying down is not recommended it is said if you lie down chances are that you may not wake up and you sit down you sit down and relax and uh, people uh, you had to hydrate yourself well while walking along the track and uh, keep uh, uh, add bit of uh, lime ca- carry some lime lime juice uh, and so that uh, absorption water absorption in the body increases add some lime and along the way when you are mountaineering not to take water uh, the plastic bottles why p- plastic bottles are not recommended take uh, your uh, copper or steel b- bottle the water bottles uh, uh, plastic bottles are prepared about 3 months before it hits the shop 3 months old water and the, the normal water uh, ph is around 3 6.5 to uh, 
ఎయిట్ నార్మల్ వాటర్ షుడ్ బి ఫర్ ద బాడీ ప్లాస్టిక్ వాటర్ బాటిల్ పిహెచ్ ఈస్ లెస్ దాన్ సిక్స్ పాయింట్ ఫైవ్ ఆర్ ఫైవ్ పాయింట్ ఫైవ్ అసడిక్ ఇట్ ఈస్ నాట్ గుడ్ ఫర్ ద బాడీ ఇట్ ఈస్ నాట్ గుడ్ ఫర్ ద బాడీ నాట్ ఓన్లీ అప్ ఇన్ ద మౌంటైన్స్ హియర్ ఆల్సో అవాయిడ్ ప్లాస్టిక్ బాటిల్స్ ప్లాస్టిక్ బాటిల్స్ ఇట్ బికమ్స్ అసడిక్ అండ్ ఇట్ ఈస్ నాట్ గుడ్ ఫర్ ద బాడీ వెన్ వీ ఆర్ గోయింగ్ అప్ when the oxygen content in high altitude when oxygen content is less and we get panic panicky and we want to breathe quickly we want to breathe quickly like a greedy person wants to grab things i want to take as much as you can in yoga it talks about observe um, parigraha aparigraha 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 minimize your need not to not to be too greedy want to take in as quickly as you can slow inhale and slower exhale that is a must if you do not exhale out properly oxygen content is already low you are building up carbon dioxide content in the lungs when the carbon dioxide content in the lungs increases it triggers uh, altitude sickness carbon dioxide high content triggers altitude techne- sickness and makes your mind uh, dizzy and uh, you are not feeling well your stomach pain and uh, uncomfortable you try to exhale out all carbon dioxide slow exhale exhale out slow inhale and slower exhale and carbon dioxide if they are not exhaled properly it again it mixes with the blood stream and becomes carbonic acid and makes the blood acidic it makes the blood acidic try to exhale out as long as you can and exhale out as completely as you can slow inhale and slower exhale you have to exhale out as slow as you can and our uh, vasudeva kriya yoga breathing technique is aimed at that one you are inhaling for a count and you are exhaling out for the four, count of four and um, you are exhaling out uh, slower and longer helps in detoxifying the lungs and um, helps in oxy- oxygen absorption in the lungs and um, helps in boosting up your uh, immunity system also immunity system and uh, in the high altitude try to as you are going up slow inhale and slower exhale while walking you can op- breathe through your mouth also mouth in the scriptures talk about you try to take in as much as you can through all channels mouth is one of the channels nostrils are another channel if required you can inhale and try to exhale exhale uh, as long as you can and um, yogis up in the mountain when the when the oxygen content is uh, low we think people survive uh, uh, do not survive long and if you do not survive long if you do not know how to breathe many people get uh, the cardiac arrest in the high altitude is common if you do not know how to breathe properly but yogis up in the mountain they live longer they live healthy and the how through the breathing technique breathing technique through pranayama through pranayama techniques they know how to keep themselves warm in a frigid condition or if it is a hot condition through pranayama how to cool them down pranayama helps in uh, keeping the body warm or cold and also helps in detoxifying the lungs yogis up in the mountain it is a known fact they live longer healthy and they can calm their mind they can focus their mind through pranayama they manage their mind so that they can focus on higher ideals in their life 
when they come down to the plains so many distractions mind cannot be focused when we go up in the higher altitude distractions are minimized when we are going up it is an opportunity for us our team to focus on higher possibilities in our life that focus you won't get in your plane when you come down in the plane so many distractions when you go up it's an opportunity for you to contemplate on higher possibilities in life that is why many yogis go up there spend want to spend time they want to see what are the possibilities in our life higher possibilities they want to explore to explore for the same reason we are also going up going up to explore the what are the higher possibilities in our life not limited to what we see here however that uh, the when the mind opens up mind opens up earlier i mentioned santosha happiness the whatever i do it will become an expression of joy how can i discover the higher possibilities in our life our yoga sadhana trek um, sadhana trip to himalayas are aimed at elevating our base camp instead of remaining only in uh, uh, dehradun base camp how to elevate when i elevate my my base camp when i go up i don't slip down to the ordinary rut of the life by base camp will support me will prevent me never to slip down to the old habits my base camp is elevated so that i won't slip down to the old habits and also when we are going up i talked about the precautions while coming down also oxygen content is slowly increasing we should not be in a running down the mountain to reach the base camp as the oxygen content is increasing slowly your lungs must get utilized for higher oxygen content not to rush down quickly walk steadily steady pace let your lungs get adjusted for higher oxygen content in the otherwise it may um, people may experience some chest pain if they start rushing down quickly and come down steadily going up in the mountain ranges when we are climbing ascending that <coughs> himalayan region is frequently a hanuman is roaming in himalayan region hanuman is regarded as a prana prana life force think of hanuman while going up in the mountain we need the prana shakti we need abundance of energy when we are climbing up in the mountain vasudev kriya yoga breathing technique helps in detoxifying the body removes the carbon dioxide from the system makes the body healthy life span increases it's a mantra kriya pranayama all combined together this message of going up in the himalayas it is a universal message whether you are going to himalayas or not you try to elevate your base camp go higher never try to come down to the your old habits that is yoga yoga is aimed at sustaining your base camp and elevating your base camp so that you are always discovering in the uh, looking out for a higher possibilities in your life now we will do the pranayama technique the general pranayama technique it is applicable not only up in the himalayas here also uh, the what yoga is talking about exhale out give out longer than what you take in you have to exhale out the exhale out you are giving out uh, the charity 
ಚಾರಿಟಿ ದಾನ ದಾನ ಇಸ್ ಎ ಇಂಪಾರ್ಟೆಂಟ್ ಕಾಂಪೊನೆಂಟ್ ಆಫ್ ಯೋಗ ಸಾಧನ ಇಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಎಕ್ಸ್ಪ್ರೆಸ್ ಥ್ರೂ ಪ್ರಾಣಾಯಾಮ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಗಿವ್ ಔಟ್ ಮೋರ್ ದೆನ್ ವಾಟ್ ಯು ಟೇಕ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಚಾರಿಟಿ ದಾನ ಇಸ್ ನಥಿಂಗ್ ಬಟ್ ಗಿವಿಂಗ್ ಔಟ್ ವಾಟ್ ಯು ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಸೊ ದ್ಯಾಟ್ ಡಿಸ್ಕವರ್ ದ ಫ್ರೀಡಮ್ ಪ್ರಾಣಾಯಾಮ ಎಲ್ಸ್ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಇಸ್ ಏಮ್ ಡ್ಯಾಟ್ ಗಿವಿಂಗ್ ಔಟ್ ಎಕ್ಸೇಲ್ ಟು ಡಿಸ್ಕವರ್ ದ ಫ್ರೀಡಮ್ ಇನ್ ಲೈಫ್ ಕ್ಲೋಸ್ ಯುವರ್ ರೈಟ್ ನೋಸ್ಟ್ರಿಲ್ ಕಂಪ್ಲೀಟ್ ಎಕ್ಸೇಲ್ ಥ್ರೂ ಲೆಫ್ಟ್ ಇನ್ಹೇಲ್ ಥ್ರೂ ಲೆಫ್ಟ್ ಫಾರ್ ದ ಕೌಂಟ್ ಆಫ್ ಫೈ ಒನ್ ಟು ತ್ರೀ ಫೋರ್ ಫೈ ಕ್ಲೋಸ್ ಯುವರ್ ಲೆಫ್ಟ್ ನೋಸ್ಟ್ರಿಲ್ ಎಕ್ಸೇಲ್ ಥ್ರೂ ರೈಟ್ ಒನ್ ಟು ತ್ರೀ ಫೋರ್ ಫೈ ಸಿಕ್ಸ್ ಸೆವೆನ್ ಏಟ್ ನೈನ್ ಟೆನ್ ಇನ್ಹೇಲ್ ಥ್ರೂ ರೈಟ್ ಒನ್ ಟೂ ತ್ರೀ ಫೋರ್ ಫೈ ಎಕ್ಸೇಲ್ ಥ್ರೂ ಲೆಫ್ಟ್ ಒನ್ ಟೂ ತ್ರೀ ಫೋರ್ ಫೈ ಸಿಕ್ಸ್ ಸೆವೆನ್ ಏಟ್ ನೈನ್ ಟೆನ್ ಇನ್ಹೇಲ್ ಥ್ರೂ ಲೆಫ್ಟ್ ಒನ್ ಟೂ ತ್ರೀ ಫೋರ್ ಫೈ ಎಕ್ಸೇಲ್ ಥ್ರೂ ರೈಟ್ ಒನ್ ಟು ತ್ರೀ ಫೋರ್ ಫೈ ಸಿಕ್ಸ್ ಸೆವೆನ್ ಏಟ್ ನೈನ್ ಟೆನ್ ಲೆವೆನ್ ಟ್ವೆಲ್ ಥರ್ಟೀನ್ ಫೋರ್ಟೀನ್ ಫಿಫ್ಟೀನ್ ಇನ್ಹೇಲ್ ಥ್ರೂ ರೈಟ್ ಒನ್ ಟು ತ್ರೀ ಫೋರ್ ಫೈ ಎಕ್ಸೇಲ್ ಥ್ರೂ ಲೆಫ್ಟ್ ಒನ್ ಟು ತ್ರೀ ಫೋರ್ ಫೈ ಸಿಕ್ಸ್ ಸೆವೆನ್ ಏಟ್ ನೈನ್ ಟೆನ್ ಲೆವೆನ್ ಟ್ವೆಲ್ ಥರ್ಟೀನ್ ಫೋರ್ಟೀನ್ ಫಿಫ್ಟೀನ್ ಇನ್ಹೇಲ್ ಥ್ರೂ ಲೆಫ್ಟ್ ಒನ್ ಟು ತ್ರೀ ಫೋರ್ ಫೈ ಎಕ್ಸೇಲ್ ಥ್ರೂ ರೈಟ್ ಒನ್ ಟು ತ್ರೀ ಫೋರ್ ಫೈ ಸಿಕ್ಸ್ ಸೆವೆನ್ ಏಟ್ ನೈನ್ ಟೆನ್ ಲೆವೆನ್ ಟ್ವೆಲ್ ಥರ್ಟೀನ್ ಫೋರ್ಟೀನ್ ಫಿಫ್ಟೀನ್ ಇನ್ಹೇಲ್ ಥ್ರೂ ರೈಟ್ ಒನ್ ಟು ತ್ರೀ ಫೋರ್ ಫೈ ಎಕ್ಸೇಲ್ ಥ್ರೂ ಲೆಫ್ಟ್ ಒನ್ ಟು ತ್ರೀ ಫೋರ್ ಫೈ ಸಿಕ್ಸ್ ಸೆವೆನ್ ಏಟ್ ನೈನ್ ಟೆನ್ ಲೆವೆನ್ ಟ್ವೆಲ್ ಥರ್ಟೀನ್ ಫೋರ್ಟೀನ್ ಫಿಫ್ಟೀನ್